welcome back to the channel and if you haven't seen any of our videos before then I urge you to go and have a look at our back catalogue. Anyway, today I have a question and that question is this, is my Tetra Panix alive or is it dead? Okay, so here we have uh, one of our specimens, it doesn't look very good, usually you've got like a nice little bit of uh, leaf growth on the top here, and really it's just a little bit of a, uh, a dead stick. Let's go and have a look at another one. This one doesn't look an awful lot better, look at this. That, uh, okay, well, that should be alive, and uh, as you can see it's dead, and there really doesn't seem to be any good new growth on the top of here, but do you know what? Not all is lost, so I'm going to show you why. Well, despite those main trunks looking dead, especially the tips, um, just because those trunks are dead doesn't mean that the plant is dead because we found at the base of these plants a number of shoes. So we've lifted those and you can see these appear to be in much better condition. We've got lush growth coming out. All this is still alive and lovely. And what's more, you will notice on the side, don't get a better picture of that, these. This is your new buds that are breaking off of the trunk. We've got another one here. I've got about half a dozen of these babies that have come out. Again, it all looks good and they're all out in the same temperature. But again, you've got this new growth. You've got bud coming down here. And the chances are, we'll get some more of these new uh, underground shoots coming up as the season progresses. Okay, so back to this one. And um, you know what, it's not looking good at all. It's, uh, you've got, um, like you see there, you've got some uplifting of the bark so this is all dead it's a bit spongy down here and you know we get a bit tougher down here and there's there is evidence that there might be some uh dormant shoot that's going to come up at the moment not much is happening but i wouldn't worry just yet i'd wait until the spring starts if you don't start to see bud coming from the uh from the trunk i still be inclined to leave it because you never know you might get some new growth coming out from the base let's go and have a look at that other plant I'll tell you what, it's not much good news on this one either. Um, there's no, I mean, there's evidence of some side shoots, but these might be old and they seem pretty tough. Uh, I would say, on the whole of it, these two specimen plants haven't coped very well with the winter, but I wouldn't worry too much about that. I certainly wouldn't take them out yet. I would definitely leave them in because there's a very, very good chance that the root system and the base of these plants uh, is still in really good condition. So, are my tetrapanics dead or alive? I think there's some life in them, even though it doesn't look like it. But I think only time can tell. And even if they are dead, I fully expect new growth to come through from the base. Which I've, you know, that's good hope, isn't it? Jolly. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.